Kenya has made significant political and economic reforms that have contributed to sustained economic growth, social development, and political stability gains over the past decade. However, its key development challenges still include poverty, inequality, transparency and accountability, climate change, continued weak private sector investment, and the vulnerability of the economy to internal and external shocks. Kenya is among the leading construction hub in sub-Saharan Africa. Many research shows that mega-construction projects in Kenya will help boost growth of the country's construction industry by 8.7% from 2017 and remain steady up until 2026. So in this video we are going to be telling you the 27 mega project that is going on in Kenya and how much each one costs. But before that, please if you are new to the channel do us a favor by liking the video. Also subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell to get notified when we upload a new video. Without wasting much of your time let's delve into the video. Number 27. Capture Wasuem Road Construction is underway on the Capture Wasuem Road, which links Uganda's eastern district of Capture to Suem, the border post with Kenya. The 10.5 billion shelling road, which is nearing completion, is financed through loans from the African Development Bank and the African Development Fund. Number 26. JKIA Ryerney Highway Construction of the Jomo Kenyatta International Airport Ryerney Highway is currently underway at a cost of 59 billion shillings. The project will be completed in three stages starting with Phase 1 that is 6.5 km, which runs from JKIA to Lakoni Road and the Southern Bypass Interchange. It will cost 8 billion shillings. Number 25. Mombasa Port Expansion The Kenya Ports Authority has floated a 20 billion shillings plan to upgrade four berths at the port to handle cargo that is not packed in containers. The port of Mombasa ranked Africa's fifth busiest harbor after Morocco's Tangier Mid, Egypt's Port Said, South Africa's Durban and Nigeria's Lagos, is eyeing position 3. Number 24. Nairobi Western Bypass Construction is underway on the Nairobi Western Bypass, a 17 billion shillings highway that seeks to ease traffic congestion in the city. The 16.79 km highway, which is being undertaken by China Road and Bridge Corporation, kicks off at Gitaru on the Nairobi Nakuru Highway and links the Southern Bypass in Kikuyu. Number 23. Eastern Northern Bypass Dualing the planned expansion of Eastern and Northern Bypass roads is finally underway, with works ongoing for the Eastern Bypass. The contractor, China Communication Construction Company, has already moved to the site, with construction work now underway at Utawala in Mbakasi. Number 22. Boma's Rongai Dualing Sinoadro Construction Limited has been hired to convert Boma's Angata Rongai Kona Bariti Road into a dual carriageway in a move aimed at reducing traffic jam on the stretch. The Chinese company was in 2019 awarded the contract to dual the 22.65 km stretch of the road through a performance-based maintenance contract that gives it up to 10 years for maintenance and repair. Number 21. Tana River Nuclear Plant the Nuclear Power and Energy Agency is seeking regulatory approval for construction of a SH-540 billion nuclear power plant in Tana River. The first nuclear power plant of 1,000 MW is expected to be commissioned by 2027 and it is projected to grow to 4,000 MW by 2035. Number 20. Palm Exotica. The 23 billion shillings project, which seeks to deliver a 61-floor luxury hotel in Watamu, Kilifi County, is in limbo after NEMA declined to approve the venture, citing the project's failure to comply with zoning plan. Number 19. Kainbu Manuthika Road. Kenya is set to undertake a 10.78 billion shillings project that will see sections of a road that connects Kayambu Road to Thika Road upgraded into a dual carriageway. The project is split into six segments. The 12 km stretch from Kayambu Road to Njua will be made a dual carriageway, while the 10 km section between Njua and Kibichoy will be a single carriageway.
Number 18, Lime at Hughes Suswa Road. The government is set to redesign and reconstruct 41 kilometers road from Lime at to Suswa in a bid to end recurrent disruption and rerouting of traffic during the rainy season. The Lime at Hughes Suswa Road, which serves the Maasai Mara Game Reserve, will be reconstructed with provision for dual carriageway in the future as traffic volumes increase. Number 17. Nairobi Mass Transport System Kenya has been planning to put in place a 35 billion shillings mass public transport system in a bid to bring order into the Nairobi transport sector. The project, which is funded by the World Bank at 25.2 billion shillings and the government 9.8 billion shillings, was scheduled to begin in 2017 but that did not happen for some weird reason. Number 16. Mombasa Gate Bridge The Kenya National Highways Authority has developed a detailed design for the 85 billion shillings Mombasa Gate Bridge, with works expected to begin soon. Kenya is expected to embark on the process of acquiring land for the project and work on the relocation plan which is expected to go on until later in the year. Number 15. Dongo Kundu Bypass A Japanese consortium, Ujita Corporation Mitsubishi Corporation, is undertaking works on Phase 2 of Dongo Kundu Bypass in Mombasa. The 8.96 km dual carriageway project, expected to cost 25 billion shillings, involves construction of an interchange at the Likoni Lunga Lunga Highway and erection of two bridges, one at Mwash, spanning 660 meters, and another at Mteza straddling 1,440 meters. Number 14. Nairobi Railway City After nearly a decade of waiting, groundbreaking has been held for the proposed Nairobi Railway City, which seeks to decongest the city center. The venture that was announced in 2010 involves construction of a 425-acre urban development on the area between hale Selesi Avenue, Uru Highway and Bunyala Road, comprising transit stations, residential and commercial buildings among other features. Number 13. Mao Summit Road Construction of a toll highway from Nairobi to Mao Summit is expected to begin following the signing of a deal between Kenya and Rift Valley Connect, a consortium made up of Vinsa Highway SAS, Meridian Infrastructure Africa Fund, and Vinsa Concessions SAS. The 180 billion shillings project will involve expansion of the 180-kilometer road into a four-lane dual carriageway from Ryerney and Limeru to Mao Summit in Nakuru County. Number 12. Turkana Lambu Pipeline British energy services firm Wood Group PLC has completed design work for a massive pipeline that will move crude oil from Lakachar Fields in Turkana to the port of Lamu. The company, which was in March 2018 appointed by Kenya to undertake the front-end engineering design for the 824 km pipeline, has delivered two design options. The first option comprising a pipeline with onshore storage facilities will cost 120 billion shillings, while one with floating storage will cost 110 billion shillings. Number 11. The Pinnacle Hilton. Inaugurated in May 2017, the project comprises a five-star hotel and a 300 meters high office block that will overtake Leonardo in Santon, South Africa, as Africa's tallest building. The 255-room Hilton Nairobi Upper Hill will be hosted on the 45-story wing, while the 70-story wing will comprise greater commercial offices and a luxury shopping mall. The Pinnacle Hilton has been put on hold after running into legal issues. Number 10. Mau Mau Road Construction of a 540 km road that seeks to honor the role of Mau Mau freedom fighters in the liberation of Kenya from colonialists is underway. Offering three central Kenya counties a new artery into Nairobi, Christen Mau Mau Road, the highway will start at Kataka and Limuru, and then pass through Kamahindu and Kibichoi in Kayambu before negotiating its way through Kiniona and Kagumo and Ikichi in Miranga. Number 9. Lambu Garissa Road South African firm Robek Construction was hired to carry out the construction to bitumen standards of a 530 km highway from Lamu to Isilo via Garissa. The Lamu Isilo Road, which is the first section of the Lamu Port South Sudan Ethiopia Transport Corridor project, will be completed in four years at a cost of 62 billion shillings. Number 8. Kenal Isilo Road. Plans for the dual carriageway received a major boost in July 2020 following the start of the 16 billion shillings Canal Mario segment of the road project. The 219 km highway, which will be built in two segments, Canal Mario 84 km, 
and Mario Isiolo 135 kilometers is scheduled for completion by December 2023. Number 7. Nairobi Mombasa Expressway Four years after Kenya signed a deal with U.S. firm Betchel for construction of a 300 billion shillings expressway between Nairobi and Mombasa, the two parties are yet to agree on how to finance the project despite a series of high-level talks. Kenya wants the 473 kilometers road to be built through the public-private partnership model while Betchel is opposed to the model which it says will cost 540 billion shillings over next 25 years. Number 6. Konza Technology City The planned construction of a 1.5 trillion shelling silicon savanna in Machakos County was identified as one of the key drivers of Vision 2030. However, the project has not made any progress since its groundbreaking in 2013 except for construction of the headquarters of the Konza Technopolis Development Authority. Number 5. Tatu City, construction of a 2,500-acre mixed-use development in Ruhr, got underway in 2014 after legal battles that had put the SH-220 billion project on hold for four years. Tatu City, promoted as Kenya's first privately managed city, was launched in October 2010 but stalled shortly after due to land ownership wrangle. The issues have since been resolved. Number 4. Standard Gauge Railway Construction of the Mombasa Malaba Standard Gauge Railway was launched by President Uhuru Kenyatta on November 28, 2013. Phase 1 of the project, from Mombasa to Nairobi, was completed in 2017 at a cost of 327 billion shillings. Phase 2A, from Nairobi to Naivasha, was concluded in 2019 at 150 billion shillings. However, the project has since been put on hold due to lack of finances. Number 3. Northland City The Kenyattas are undertaking a project that will culminate in 11,000-acre estate comprising residential and commercial units hosting about 250,000 people. Dubbed Northland City, the development that is estimated to cost 500 billion shilling, will occupy an 11,576 parcel of land in Ruru, about 15 kilometers from the Nairobi city center. Number 2. Mega Dams Since April 2013, various government agencies have signed or announced more than 700 billion shillings worth of dam construction projects across the country. Several mega dams are currently under construction at a cost of 143 billion shillings. These include 37 billion shillings Thwaite Dam in Kitui, Makoni Counties, 28 billion shillings Itter Dam in Nakuru County, 24 billion shillings Karim New Dam in Kayambu County, and 5 billion shillings Sioy Muruni in West Pakot County. Number 1. Lapsit. Arguably Kenya's most ambitious venture, the 2 trillion shillings Lamu Port South Sudan Ethiopia Transport Corridor project is hoped to boost economic activities and double the country's GDP. Its main components include Lamu Port, Lamu Ethiopia South Sudan Highway, Lamu Juba Addis Ababa Railway, oil refinery, and a 2,240 km pipeline linking oil fields in South Sudan to the refinery at Lamu Port. It also includes construction of three resort cities at Lamu, Isiolo, and Lakachagio, construction of airports in the resort cities and development of a 1,100 megawatts power line and a 185 kilometers water supply line. As we come to the end of the video, please share to us anything you know or think about this ongoing mega project in Kenya. On the comment section, also remember to like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell to get notified when we upload an educating video. Thanks for watching, see you on our next video.